Hello everyone, I hope you're well. Uh, John here again. Now I've just bought uh, a Fender Professional uh, guitar and um, it came with these V-Mod pickups and I think they're, they're really good. The only thing is I don't really like this, this shawbucker. Uh, I like the way it sounds, I don't like the way it looks. So I wanted to get um, a single coil one. So I bought some Fat 50s and what I want to do is I'm going to compare these V-Mod pickups with the Fat 50s. So I'll play some chords and then I'll play some lead stuff through a, a distorted channel. See, see what you think, see what the differences are. So I'll start here on the bridge, bridge pickup. Okay, right, that's good. Now I'm gonna put some effects on. So this is going through the Blues Junior clean, but with the Andy Timmons uh, pedal, I'm using an X stomp with a cabinet simulator of a Vox cabinet uh, on there. And then I'm going through a flashback, TC Electronics flashback uh, delay. And uh, I'll do the same thing. I go through all the pickups. So we have, this this pick up test in the kind of like mid frequencies. slightly different light. I recorded it in the day and I thought well, I'll listen back to it today you know <laughs> and see what it sounded like. I've only just finished listening back to them and uh, I don't know what you think but I think in the mid frequencies you know when I'm when I'm playing around the fifth uh, fret around that area with the distortion on I think the V mods have it. I think they sound a bit better. They've got a bit more uh, it's difficult to talk about sound, isn't it? A bit more presence to them. They sound a bit more compressed, a bit more forward. 
in my ears the Fat 50 sound a bit more hollow, a bit more uh, tinny, if you want to use that as a word. They're still amazing pickups. Um, but the new 2017, you know, Fender Professional, this guitar with these pickups, these were the ones I took out, the V Mod pickups, and that's got that sure, sure bucker in. But they all sound great, they all sound really, really good. I'm surprised, really, because I really thought that the uh, that the uh, Fender Custom Shop Fat 50s were the sound, you know, I really wanted that sound. But uh, I'm quite surprised, and now I'm thinking to myself, should I put these back in again? You know, um, the tones are similar. I think it's still got that same uh, sharpness, you know, which which is nice. I like I like that the same presence. But I think just in terms of an upfront sound, especially in these mid frequencies, I think these ones are really good. So. If you're thinking of going out and buying a new, uh, you know, professional guitar, Fender professional guitar, they replaced, this model replaced the um, American Standard uh, guitar, but this one is, is very nice. I did try out the Elite guitar as well, uh, the new Fender Elite, which is about a thousand dollars more, well I'm from New Zealand here, I'm living in New Zealand, it's about a thousand dollars more, and the funny thing is, I preferred this. I was going to buy the Elite model, but I preferred the feel of this and I preferred the sound of this. And now I know why. In the Elite series, you've got the noiseless pickups, and I don't think they're as good as the V Mod pickups. And the, the frets are different also. They're, they're bigger frets, uh, uh, jumbo frets, I, I think they are in the Elite. And these are 6105s, which I like those because they're easy to bend. You can still feel the wood, you know, underneath your fingers um, or on the fretboard, which is really good. Anyway, there we go. See what you think. Leave some comments uh, down below. And I'm sorry for the sound. A friend of mine borrowed my microphone. He hasn't given it back, so that's why it sounds a bit weird. Um, anyway, have some fun. Good luck with your guitar hunting. See you next time.